It's Ketchup Packets. Hi, everybody. I'm Nate. I'm Sean. And this is Ketchup Packets. Today, we are watching Season 1, Episode 2 of The Boys, called Cherry. What do you think about The Boys, Nate? What happened in the first episode? Ooh, I love it. A uh, bunch of superheroes being awful. Mm -hmm. The Deep is awful. Yeah. Uh, the main guy is the awfulest. Homelander. Homelander. Yes. Yeah. He cut an airplane in half with yeah, his eyes. Yeah, sure did, with a kid in it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, really bad stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see, who else we got? We got the invisible guy who's dead now. Translucent. I am kind of happy that he was dead because they they used him as a sort of plot device in order to hear things that he wasn't supposed to, you know, that no one was supposed to hear and stuff. And I was mm -hmm. like, that's a little bit too easy. You can't just have somebody who can be invisible in every scene. You right. Know? People but, with these abilities create immense problems. It's true. Yep. Yep. It's bad. <laughs> um, and then we have uh, the main character, the the normal kid whose name escapes me. Huey. Not a he Huey. 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 Like, Huey. Like Huey, Dewey, Who's, and Louie. Yeah. Oh, okay. Sure, sure. I can remember that. Mm -hmm. um, his girlfriend got obliter obliterated. Yes. Yep. By A-Train. Mm -hmm. Who's the speedster. He got approached by a fake fed mm -hmm. who gave him an opportunity to infiltrate, mm -hmm. which he did do. Yes. We found out he was a fake fed. Mm -hmm. They got in a fight. They killed Translucent. Mm -hmm. And then uh, now I think uh, Translucent is in the fed's trunk they have a dead soup they, and they gotta deal soup. with that yep gotta deal with that um yeah oh yeah and then we have what is i keep wanting to say starfire but that's not, it's starlight star, starlight okay yeah yeah any january yeah and her powers seem pretty cool mm -hmm. but she's also not having a good time no. she's realizing the dark side real quick of all this starry eyed it's young superhero watch, yeah. yes and then you have madeline stillwell who is the corporate executive mm, at that's Vaught. right yeah no Sort of running the, running the seven and all that stuff. I think that about covers it for our first episode. Yeah, I think I did a pretty good job. You did. You remembered a lot. It's a memorable <laughs> TV show. Yeah, that's it really for sure. Is. So, it's Hard not hitting stuff. Yeah, definitely. So, uh, I learned something interesting about this show in the comments from our first episode. The uh, this is made in Canada, in the same place that another series we watched on this channel, The Expanse, is made. Oh, the same building that is used as UN headquarters in that show is used as Vought HQ on this show. Really? It's the same building. That's a beautiful building. It is. Yes. As watching wow. The Expanse after I heard that, I was like, I can totally see that this is Vought HQ now that I know. Mm -hmm. Like, it's very clearly the same place. So, yeah, cool. You can keep that in mind so as we watch. So it's just a giant empty building in the middle of the city that they shoot TV shows in? I don't know any more about it other than somebody said it's the same that... that Vought headquarters is the yeah. same place as the UN building from the Expanse. How so. often a bunch of office workers just have to like not do their jobs for months on end because a TV show has to film in that building? I mean, there are places that do that. There's like there's the the one super big mansion that's been in like a zillion movies yeah, yeah. about big mansions, or, <laughs> <laughs> not about them, but yeah. movies yeah. that have a big mansion in them, or like I think the offices on Mad Men were also the same offices that they used on the show Better Off Ted, which is like a sitcom, you know. It's Never. Like, Never seen it, but I see. Well, hey, interesting. Yeah. yeah, they reuse locations between shows, so that's fun. But uh, we're, we should watch the boys. Yeah, totally. Well, All right. Quick note first: if you guys want to check out the Patreon, the links down below. Please do. That's all I'm going to say about that. Let's do it. All right. Oh, shit. I was wondering at first how the Fed guy, fake Fed guy. Butcher. Was, Butcher was able to figure out like that this was going on so quickly, and then I realized that they had the tracker. Mm -hmm. So he's probably he was like, that's supposed to be somewhere else. He pulled away, yeah. probably saw the tracker was on its way to where he just left and went yep. back. Guess we'd take more than that, that, huh? Well, we have a different problem yeah. now. Yeah. Oh, thank fuck, he's alive. Yes! No. Yes, he's alive! Okay, pull over. No, 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 Huey, you don't fucking get it. Pull the car! This over. fuck sight worse. He's seen it, I'm facing <laughs> Yeah, it's a lot worse, Huey. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Morning, love. Frenchy about. <laughs> Interesting.
thing. I don't get that at all. Yeah. There you go. This is definitely where you want to be. You dumb fucks are fucking dead. Have you ate? Let's try to slow something. You got to resource it in your tongue, huh? Nothing gets past you, mate. Whoa, 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 whoa! Go away. Get him out of here. All right, all right, easy. He's cheap, huh? The soups can be on their way. Homelander can be on his way right now. Wait, he's chipped? You bring this to my doorstep. This is not my problem, huh? Well, it is now. He knows what you look like. Look, Fredgy, I need your help, mate. And I ain't leaving until I get it. What till the seven show up? Oh man. It's a pretty dirty move yeah. of him, huh? Doesn't really seem like a good idea to drag him into this. Maybe I can't turn invisible, but I am the world's fastest man. Like I can outrun anybody or anything. That's that's something, right? Like I tell you what, you get better and I'll teach you to run as fast as me. Yeah? Yeah? You'll teach me to outrun cancer? I'm laughing at the smiley faces, guys. Yeah. I'm not laughing. It's, We're it's laughing at how horrible it is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's supposed to be funny. Black Noir. We haven't properly met yet. I'm Starlight. I look forward to working with you. There she is. Not very friendly. Uh, you know, back in Des Moines, I always patrolled alone. And that is why we love you. But we see at least a 23% uptick in social media mentions and hero hashtags when there's a team up. People love a team up. Love a team up. Mm. Yeah. Just be like, can I go with someone else, please? <laughs> yeah. Sunshine, you know who I am? Not sure. I know so many invisible assholes. <laughs> Fucking amateurs. Huh. What the fuck? Ooh, mind them bars, son. You only bollocks yourself again. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, okay, what do you guys want? Money? We don't want your fucking money. <laughs> Feel bad for the actor that plays translucent. He doesn't have to be in like half of his scenes. What do you think? Do you feel bad for him? Well, I don't know. It seems easier. We need to pierce the skin somehow. Well, how the hell are we gonna do that? I don't know. You're gonna kill him? <laughs> oh, come on. Get with the program. We didn't bring him here for a fucking happy meal. <laughs> I don't- I thought we'd question him or something. I don't know. You get a- you get a hold of someone this big. Hey, Gitmo. We had to waterboard Khalid Shay Muhammad 183 times over six months. To get him to talk just once. Now we ain't got six months. I doubt we've even got six hours. There are so many crazy things about what you just said. <laughs> right now, I'm not a murderer. That's all right. I am. The race is coming up quickly. How are you feeling? Look, A Train is a fierce competitor, but no one could be the worst. Soups on Sports be Center, forever. because of course yeah, they would yeah. be. Yep. Personally, I think it's amazing that a woman your age can have a baby, period. That is so sweet of you to say. Oh, my God. oh no problem. Is that Please sweet? No, up. it's not. He's a jerk. Mm -hmm. You don't do vengeance. Madeline, I heard him through the wall. Uh, he was blackmailing you. I am the last person you need to save. Yeah, but I, I did it for you. I know. But did the timing occur to you? I have half the Senate Appropriations Committee coming tonight. <laughs> you just need to let me protect you. Oh, you're going to protect me? Mm-hmm. Gods are pure 
And they're perfect. And they're above it all. And they need to stay that way. Yeah, I can't be shooting down planes, man. This is some yeah. lo lovely creepiness. You should probably call your dad, Huey. Yeah. He's gonna worry you're up to no good. Hi, Dad. Huey, where have you been? I've been calling hospitals. I'm fine. Look, the police are saying some wacko drove into Gary's store right through the window and then took off. Yeah, he's, yeah. Uh, he has reason to be worried. Yeah, it's kind of hard to explain. <laughs> hey, Dad, listen, I gotta, I gotta go. Just, listen, I know you've been taking Robin's accident real hard. It wasn't an accident. All right, all right. All right. My point is, you're a good boy. You're a sensitive boy. Come home. Okay, before you do something stupid, come home, Huey. I gotta go. No, w wait, you... The dad's writing is really good. I mean, you can see why he's like this. He's trying his best to be, like, supportive and stuff, but he's yeah. also just like, you're weak and you're pathetic. Just <laughs> let it go. Right. Ow. Oh, yeah. Oh. No! Break your hands, dude. You need those. Oh. He's very upset. His girlfriend died, and now he's got yeah. a famous hostage. You know? <laughs> yeah. It's rough. You and me. Come on in. You can see the deep is like very intimidated. It's not like being in a room alone with him. Mm -hmm. I mean, this man can literally so, kill you with a mm -hmm. gaze if he decides to. Or is there? I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. I, I, I didn't. I didn't really see anything down there. As a matter of fact. That's what I thought. Him having his hands on you at all would be so yeah, scary. Yeah, Because, like, he can just increase the, the pressure. Yeah. yeah. Uh, go fuck Shamu in the blow. <laughs> yeah. I'm lucky his power isn't that thing where people do everything he says. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> shit, 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 shit. Don't you take all that. Did he take some acid? Looks like it. Well, I guess he's got his process. Mm-hmm. What's he cooking up? Looks like a custom rifle round. Rounds coated in the same carbon metamaterial as his skin. Cool. Don't know if it works. Translucent bleeds. We know that much, so. No, that was uh, Butcher's own blood that he was spitting on. Yeah, that's right. Didn't work. You stupid fucking asshole. I'm invincible. You stupid No, you're invisible. <laughs> Time before they come for me, you're fucking dead. Uh oh, at least somewhere in this 10 block area. That is the best you can do. It's possible the chip's glitching, or are there some kind of interference. Okay. Tell security to search the area door to door if necessary. I tell them to be discreet. He is invisible, so it shouldn't be that hard. Okay. <laughs> Wait, it shouldn't be the, the yeah. him, his invisibility should make it very difficult. Yeah. What's your problem? You had that pissy look on your face all night. I wonder, dude. <laughs> She's making all the lights yeah. flicker. <laughs> Is this about the other night again? Again? Oh my god. Jesus. When are you gonna Christ. let that go? Yeah, Jesus. Cry me a fucking river. Sure. Okay, I took my share of shit when I first got here, okay? <sighs> Sorry. You had a crush on me, remember? That gives you no right. Zero right to do what you did, you pathetic asshole. Hey, you shut your fucking mouth. Or what? You'll sick a grouper on me? I'll tell everyone. You stuck up, little... If you ever touch me again, I will burn your eyes out. Understand me? 
cool. Go Annie. Yeah, at least she can like later. intimidate the shit out of him. Mm -hmm. from yes. That's nice to see after what happened yeah. last time. He deserves He deserves more worse than, than that, this. but yes. That's cool. Yeah, that. I mean, that's not animated. Now there's now it is, CG yeah. happening, but yeah, I think they were yeah. moving Why a yeah. real glass of water around in the air. Homelander's gonna find you, and when he does, he's gonna burst you wide open. I'm gonna make it home in time for cocktails, because that's who you are, and that's who I am. You're not the hero of the story, and I'm not the one who's trapped. Whoa. Well, good luck. I tried. Huey so, seems not too worried by it, but it was a pretty persuasive yeah. scary speech. Yep. No one's putting soups in the national defense. It won't get out of committee, much less hit the floor. Because God forbid we could have an advantage in an armed conflict. You send a soup over the 38th parallel. Pyongyang's going to answer with a nuke. Then one of my guys will catch it. You see Every time? Over there. Yeah. He's got Lockheed. Better be sure. It'll be more fun at the party. Please. Okay, don't touch me. No, please, please. No, 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 please. No, 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 no. The girl said no. We're all friends here. Yeah, it's all good. It's fine. <laughs> Miss, do me a favor and shut your eyes. You know, swing on her after she does that? Yeah, no, I think I'd be pretty shocked. Well, especially if you inhabit this world, you immediately mm -hmm. think, oh, she's a oh, soup. She's a soup. Here, take it. What is that? It will help with your uh, anxiety. It's LSD and MDMA. This is a candy flip. Just smooth you right out. Take it. Uh, thank you. <laughs> smooth you right out. For a major hallucinogen. <laughs> Frenchy just takes two instead. <laughs> what are you? Exactly. Chemist, what? Engineer? What if they just attack what? his brain? I know a little about a lot of things. I'm a gun. Like give him drugs. Poison him. Drugs. Yeah. Hey, is that your uh, secret identity? Mm -hmm. Charming. Thanks. Yeah, I, I gave up on mine. Oh, a long time ago now. I think I'm going to go to sleep. Hmm. Good night. So is he just staring at himself out of narcissism, or is he deep in thought about Super what he's become? Think about Superman abilities. Got it. It's a lot of them. He can do a lot of different yeah. things. I realize uh, how busy you were last night. <laughs> These are fake. I think we both know they're not. I was with a young woman, all right? Of legal age. Her name was Rhonda. I'm sorry, they're authentic. I should know. I was there. You what? You shiver when you orgasm, sir. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> it's not fatal to be a homosexual these days. It is in Oklahoma, sir. Where your voters live. Even if I get the bill Another out superhero of show with Oklahoma no involved. Yeah. <laughs> on the floor. No one wants your fucking suits in the army. We'll see. Hey, 
This poor girl getting bossed around <laughs> yeah. by people. Why don't I just call Miss Stillwell? No. No, no, no. You're talking to me. Well, I'm not sure I'm supposed to be talking. To What's your name? Annika. Annika. It's a beautiful name. <laughs> Listen, Annika. I'm the Homelander. Mm -hmm. And I can do whatever the fuck I want. <laughs> <laughs> Now, translucent, last known position. This actor who plays Homelander is so yeah, good. He's very good. If I stick something down your throat, you may vomit it up. There's truly only one way. What did you do to me? He stuck a lump of plastique up your bum, son. S bomb. S bomb. <laughs> Now, you stick a little finger up there and try and fish it out. Bang. I trigger this. Also bang. It's heavy. Oh, please don't kill me. <laughs> I'll do anything. I'll tell you about any dream. That's what the kid wants, right? He's so scared once he's in actual yeah. danger. They're only brave yeah, because they think they're completely untouchable, you know? But unfortunately for you, we're out of time. No. No. Please. Yep. Listen, I know shit. Dark shit. All the way to the top. Wait, wait. No, 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 no. Please, wait, wait, wait. Listen, I can help you. I'm fucking invisible. We can be invisible. Butcher. No, please, wait, wait. wait. I can help you. Hey, he probably doesn't know a lot of shit if he's yeah, invisible he and he does. hangs out in Seven Tower. Yep. Oh, here. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. He can see us. He's got x-ray vision. He can see through the fucking roof. And super fucking hearing. You pull the detonator, he will hear. Even if the bomb goes off within, like, a indestructible diamond case? I mean, the skin is impenetrable either way, right? That's pretty smart of him. Yep. He's the Homelander. I am talking to the Homelander. Mm-hmm. Sir, I need to see some ID. Get the fuck back in that cage. Just take it easy. Okay? What are you doing out here? This is my place. We am uh, opening a fog with the shot. You know where the Chavez Gavin is? Please get back in the cage. I'm not getting back in that cage, man. I do. I am dead. Well, if you don't, you're dead. Yeah, dude, this guy would be so scary. <laughs> he's got yeah, so many, he's yeah. Gonna he's gonna mess, yeah. It's all bad. Honestly, the idea that they're able to outwit him here is a little mm -hmm. unbelievable, you know, it's like he doesn't seem like he'd be beatable in any situation. Yeah, totally. Look, you let me go. You'll be the hero that saved Translucent. No. Don't trust him. It's not too late. You're still <laughs> gone. I don't yeah. think Huey believes that. I mean, no. that's a very unbelievable that's promise. Right. boy. You let him go. You're all dead. There you go. So it breaks for some reason. <laughs> yeah. Not impenetrable from the inside. I didn't want no. to give away that I knew yeah. that, but. <laughs> Congratulations, Huey. Kill the soup. <laughs> Frenchie said you can count on one hand the number of dead soups, and now mm -hmm. Huey's on the list of somebody who's killed one, so yeah, wow. that's pretty cool. Is that cool? I mean, it's noteworthy. No, we'll say that, you know? Huey's now a name you can write down in historical yep. texts. In the, 
on the list of people who killed soups. The people who everyone else believes are the heroes who keep protect everyone. You're responsible for one of their deaths. Congratulations. Yeah, you might go on a list of all-time horrible yeah, people, honestly. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Wow. Yeah, this show's great. Yeah, yeah it is. It's pretty awesome. good. What, is your, what are your thoughts on episode two? Are you surprised that Translucent actually died right there? No, I think that once they figured it out, I was pretty much just like, yep, this is it. He's going to die because that, that kicks off everything else. Mm -hmm. Because now they're looking for him and his blood is all over the place. Mm -hmm. They needed to kill him in a messy way in order for this particular like story, the story beats to continue. Yeah. And like, there's no way, I mean, and now Homelander is in the area. I would say there's a good chance he probably heard that. But he's already or, investigating the explosion he just heard. Yeah, so that's true. I mean, might not be paying attention. Who yeah, knows? Yeah, maybe. I love. Yeah, Homelander as a character is extremely interesting. Mm -hmm. Just he he. Being able to be that terrifying to everyone around you at all times, I can see how somebody would lose track of how evil they actually are. You yeah, know, like, how do you have a moral compass? It's like, yeah. have you watched Jessica Jones? No. Okay, well, I mentioned while we were watching this, a superpower that's depicted on that show, where the villain on Jessica Jones has the ability where anything yep. he tells people they will do, and like, he says it to them, and then in the in that moment, it's what they want to do freely. They, they do, mm -hmm. They're not like, I'm being puppeteered. Like, he right. changes what they want to do for a few minutes. Right. And then, cool. like, as, if he stops giving instructions, they go back a few minutes later, but it's like, they just do what he wants. And that character's a really interesting villain because it's like, if that's how the world works for you, yeah. how do you not be evil? Mm -hmm. You know, it's like, how could you keep yourself from using that ability if it always works, you yeah. know? You just say to people, Stop talking to me, and they stop talking they to stop, you. Or, yeah, you, know, you know, like go get me that thing, and they go and do it immediately. You know, and it, like, and it just no matter what, it always works. And so it's it, it, Homelander's sort of the same thing. Of when you've got that much power, it's almost impossible not to be evil, mm -hmm. because that's just how you un, you yeah. grow up learning. That's how the world functions. You, you know? would never ever have any true repercussions for your actions mm -hmm. because no prison can hold you. Yeah. No. Nobody no can one, inflict consequences yeah. on you of any kind. Yeah. You know, we're going to teach you a lesson, mister, is not mm -hmm. something you've ever heard in your entire life, really. I'm sure all of his teachers and his parents and everyone were just terrified well, for the next time he threw a tantrum. You'll have to learn more about his past yeah. as you go into the show. I think it's interesting, though, that Stillwell, we saw a little bit here, seems to have a bit of a strategy of trying to deal with them a little mm -hmm. bit. You know, there was sort of an emotional connection she was making. Yeah. There, so seems like you would have to develop techniques like that to try, you know, you can't use normal interpersonal politics techniques yeah. on a person like that. Yeah, and that's sort of the other thing is when everyone is always so terrified in your very presence, mm -hmm. the moment you find somebody who sort of feels like they can manipulate you, you know, that you're going to be easily manipulated. You don't yeah. have to learn any mind tricks. You don't have to... Ever, yeah. You can pretty much drag the truth out of anyone at any moment just by threatening them physically. You don't even you know need I mean? to overtly threaten them. Just stand there and be yeah. as powerful as you mm -hmm. are. They'll, they're afraid of your very existence. So, so right. he seems like he's kind of, that's like his weakness a little bit, is people who can dance or Because he's also not particularly intelligent. Just because he's infinitely perceptive yeah, doesn't well, mean right. he's intelligent. He doesn't no. need to be. He's yeah, never, no, there was no need for him to develop intelligence. Creative problem solving is not in his wheelhouse. He yeah. smashes through things or looks right through the wall. Or, or demands, demands what he wants. Yeah, exactly. So yeah. it's, you know, that's actually kind of surprising to me that they, not surprising, but I, I was just like, they could write this character super flat, make mm -hmm. him like Superman, but evil. But yeah. they sort of did a cool thing with him. I, I appreciate the, the writing on and the acting on his character is really incredible. I'm glad you're already perceiving that this early into the series mm -hmm. because I definitely think it's one of the boys' strong points. And so it only continues to be uh, one of the most interesting parts of this series. So I'm glad that you've already mm -hmm. picked up on that. Yeah. What did you think of the little bits of black noir we've gotten so far? Yeah. <laughs> well, let's just say I don't feel like I know much about his character yet. <laughs> I don't think you're supposed to. <laughs> yeah. He hasn't said very much, so that's or anything at all. No, he's, he he's, he's their Batman, you know? Yeah, exactly. He's supposed he's to be Batman. Kind of like, <laughs> yeah, so I wonder, I do kind of wonder how he's going to play into all this, because mm -hmm. he also got kind of introduced later than all the other supers who we've met, and 
with no character. You know, right away we got an idea for every single one of these characters so far. Didn't they, wasn't he standing there with that beverage with the straw? That's that's a character. Yeah, thing, I guess right? he was he trying drinks, to suck. drinks liquids. Yeah. He was, <laughs> It looked like he was try thinking about grabbing an hors d'oeuvre, and then he realized he would have to like maybe lift his mask or something in order mm -hmm. to eat it. So yeah. that's kind of fun. I mean, he could end up being—I don't know. If I was going to predict, I'd say that he ends up being—he seems like kind of the black sheep. And so, well, I mean, obviously, being like a Batman character, it would mm -hmm. also feed into that whole thing. But uh, probably because he's not a total unredeemable piece of garbage like the rest of them are. You think he just keeps to himself because he just doesn't want to yeah, fraternize with these like, people? These guys are all you know? fucking horrible. But yeah. he uses the power afforded to him by being in the Seven to do... Mm -hmm. To maybe do some things. good. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. Some reasonable thought. <laughs> I've been wrong before. Right. Well, and Butcher did say that to a person, every one of them is a bad person, but we see that that's not true of Starlight at the mm -hmm. very least. So Butcher seems unreliable in that, you know, yeah. maybe he has reason to be yeah. biased against like soups. He's got a bone to pick. He's got mm -hmm. a little bit of a grudge against the whole concept without thinking of them as indivis individuals, you know, mm -hmm. it's just kind of yeah. you're super, you're bad, and that's, you know, as we know of anyone, it's not necessarily true, you know. All just folk. Mm-hmm. And, yeah, Starlight's little, uh, her saving somebody on her own terms ended up being a huge problem, which mm -hmm. I'm figuring that throughout this storyline the sheer idea that like what you mean i can't save somebody in trouble because it's not on your it's schedule not sanctioned you know? yeah. yeah exactly and that no one would take her word mm -hmm. on why she was she was like we're supposed to be good right like we're supposed to do good things and then by doing good things the public is supposed to assume that what we're doing is good but it seems like there's probably been some, it seems like they spend a lot of time covering up, like make, doing PR stunts to cover right. up the bad things that these people do. So. Well, and also because there's this big corporation behind the soups, I think, it makes them vulnerable to lawsuit for wrongful assault. You know, like mm -hmm. what they're doing is illegal in other contexts and yep. attacking people and stuff. So that's why like those guys in that alleyway, if she, because she's not able to prove that they were committing a rape, mm -hmm. then all of a sudden, oh, she attacked us, and we're gonna, you know, they see a potential payday yeah. because there's a corporation behind her that they could get money from. So. Yeah, that's probably just her sort of idealization of what she is like a part of. Just yeah. Being like, yeah, we're supposed to help people. It's like, you're supposed to help people, but the moment you <laughs> you <laughs> put yourself in a position like that, like, mm -hmm. they people might take their word on it that right. he's attacking people for no reason. Well, and she also, you know, when she was operating on her own in Des Moines, that's probably how she, mm -hmm. you know, she would see a crime and she'd go stop it because she's just one superhero and there's not a deep pockets to go after if you're going to try to sue yep. her for attacking you, you know, but... And also, there's, you know, in a... Des Moines is not a, like a small town or anything like that, but it's, you know, it's smaller than the metropolis that they're in now. Mm -hmm. and yeah, it's yeah. sort of like big fish, little pond... Everyone probably knew. Yeah, like, Starlight. About her. Yeah, she it's was like the hero Starlight. of Des Moines or whatever. Yeah, yeah they exactly. Called. They had a nickname. Mm -hmm. but. Yeah. Wow. Super interesting. Well, anything else on this one? Uh, not that I can think of. No. I mean, there's. I'm excited to get going on yeah. more of it. I I know what's to come, and you still have no idea. So. Yeah, that's right. And uh, I think we're on track to get through this right around on time for when season three comes in june Ooh. so starting then we'll be watching new ones together Sweet. and with the audience we'll be getting new episodes as well and we'll all get be going excited through. so yeah yeah first first series that we'll be catching up to live if we can get it all right to keep our schedule on track so yeah yeah let's that's do good it. stuff mm -hmm. well everybody thanks so much for joining us mm -hmm. uh, this has been great i'm super glad to see that everyone's enjoying the boys i i know i am yeah and uh yeah stick with it um, I'm Nate. I'm Sean. And this is Ketchup Packets.